a breakdown of every popular DJ software. In my journey with this channel, I have used and reviewed every popular DJ software out there. No, I'm not talking about Traktor. I said popular DJ software. Now with that said, I have my opinions. Today, I'm gonna break down each software and who I think would benefit the most from it. Let's get into it. Brand new DJs should use Serato. There, I said it. What the hell? If you know me, you know I have my issues with Serato. However, it is stable, it does have plenty of features, it's got great hardware support, and honestly, I think it's the best software for a DJ to learn on. Mostly because the beat grids are ass, so things like sync just don't work well. Which means, as a new DJ, you're gonna have to learn to mix using your ears and your eyes, which is not a bad thing. There are tons of hardware available for Serato DJ Lite and Serato DJ Pro, which means your hardware can grow with your software. Most of all, it just works, and it works well. I knew it. You can own a base version of Serato DJ Pro for a $9.99 a month subscription fee or a one-time payment of $249. If you want the added features like Serato Play, DVS, or access to Club Kit, you're gonna have to shell out $14.99 a month or a one-time payment of $449. With that said, if you buy Serato hardware, then you get a free license of the basic software. However, if you want those extra features, you're still gonna have to shell out that $14.99 a month or pay that one-time $449. $49 fee. Come on! Techie DJs should use Virtual DJ. I am a genius. Virtual DJ is a program for people who love to tinker. Virtual DJ is hands down the most customizable software on the market today. There is no hardware that isn't compatible. You can literally adjust everything and you can even use skins. I know that all sounds cool, but hear me out. There is a reason why most software companies do not give you that much control. The more you can change, the more you can f something up. Which leads me back to my conclusion that techie DJs should use Virtual DJ. You really have to invest time into the software to benefit from using it. Not all things just work out of the box, and sometimes to get things to work, you have to do some configuring. Let's not even talk about the hoops you have to jump through just to use DVS. It's a fantastic piece of software, you just really need to know what you're doing with it. It's also the best value on this list. It comes in at a monthly subscription of $19 a month for the pro version or a one-time fee of $299. Keep in mind, if you do the one-time fee of $299, you get updates for life. Yes! Hell yeah! Hands down, the best value software on the market today. However, it is not for everyone. Club DJs should be using Rekordbox. Most major clubs use the standard kit of a Pioneer 4-channel mixer and CDJs, which is one of the reasons why Rekordbox makes the most sense for club DJs. The one downside is it's just for Pioneer hardware, Whack. which is kind of a bummer. But like I said, if you're playing at a nightclub, they're most likely gonna have Pioneer stuff anyway, so it really doesn't matter. Rekordbox is also packed full of really awesome features. My favorite being the cloud live Library. Using a combination of Rekordbox and Dropbox, you can put your library and playlists in the cloud and have access to them on various other devices. You can also use Rekordbox to prep a playlist and put it on a USB stick. That way you don't even have to bring a laptop with you when you go to the club. They even have an app for iOS and iPad OS so you can work on your playlists on the go using the cloud library. You can also connect certain hardware to an iPad and DJ using an iPad and your cloud library. The biggest downfall to Rekordbox is the price. It's subscription only and subscriptions start at $11 a month and go all the way up to $36 a month. However, if you want every feature in Rekordbox and the largest amount of storage in your Dropbox library, then you're gonna have to shell out $36 a month or $360 a year. Damn! However, if you're serious about becoming a club DJ and want to work in these major nightclubs, then you want to make that investment in a record box because it just seems like the most logical thing to do. Mobile DJ should give Algorithms DJ Pro a try. Not only is DJ Pro packed full of a ton of nifty features from mobile events, but it's also available on almost every device out there. Wow. There are desktop versions for Mac and Windows, as well as mobile versions for iOS, iPad OS, and Android. If I'm being real with you, the Apple version version usually gets all the best updates and features and they also have the best hardware support. We're the best. Having one singular program 
for every device as a mobile DJ is huge. Imagine you're a wedding DJ and you have to provide sound for the ceremony, cocktail hour, and reception. You can literally use the same program at every space. And if you're an Apple user, you can have your exact same library on every device. DJ Pro comes in at a monthly subscription of $6.99 a month or an annual subscription of $49.99 a year. No matter what you pick though, you get access to the full software and all of its features. <laughs> Excellent. At the end of the day, this is just my opinion, and realistically, you're gonna have to do your own research when it comes to choosing DJ software. My biggest piece of advice is, Figure out your lane. Do you need something that's really customizable and works with everything? Or do you want something more focused in the type of events you wanna do? These are all things you need to figure out before you choose a DJ software. But viewers, I leave it to you. What DJ software are you using and why are you using it? Leave it in the comments. As always, if you made it to the end of this video, I'd like to say thank you so much for watching. If you found anything valuable in the content, please subscribe to the channel. We have a bunch of videos going over the tech that we use as DJs with a lot more coming down the pipeline. My name is Seth, AKA DJ Seth V. This is DJ Tech Tips. Thank you for watching and we out.